Hello and welcome ladies and gentlemen to a new edition of the Daily Debate. In tonight's show we're going to be focusing on the sixth edition of the Egypt Can Conference series held this time under the slogan Egypt Can with Industry. We're going to be talking and focusing on this sixth edition of the conference and focusing on the industrial sector, the, the prospects and the efforts and the, the goals that should be achieved as a result of this conference. But before we start doing that, let's check out some of the stories making the news today. And we'll start off with President Abdel Fattah Sisi, who received a phone call from the British Prime Minister Boris Johnson today. Now, during the phone talks, President Sisi praised the bilateral relations binding the two countries, stressing the keenness on enhancing joint cooperation during the coming period and increasing the British investments in the Egyptian market. Presidential spokesman Bassam Rodi said that the talks tackled the latest developments of the Ukrainian crisis, where the president expressed readiness to exert efforts to preserve peace and stability all over the world. The talks also focused on Egypt's preparations for the upcoming World Climate Change Conference, COP27, which will be held in Sharm el-Sheikh next November. For his part, Johnson hailed the strong ties between Egypt and the UK, stressing that Egypt is one of the most important partners in the Middle East and Africa. President Abdel Fattah Sisi also held a meeting with the French Minister of Finance and Economy Bruno Le Maire today. The presidential spokesman Bassem Rodi said that during the meeting, President Sisi delivered greetings to his French counterpart asserting the importance of the economic relations between Egypt and France. The President also reiterated that Egypt is looking forward to strengthening and expanding the joint cooperation in various fields. For his part, the French Minister affirmed his country's keenness on enlarging cooperation with Egypt, especially in the military and economic domains. Le Maire also pointed out to the significance of Egypt's leading role in the region and in facing the current challenges. The meeting touched on means of fostering bilateral relations and enlarging France's investments through several ongoing national projects across Egypt. And Foreign Minister Sameh Shukri held a meeting with Qatar's Deputy Prime Minister and Foreign Minister Mohammed bin Abdurrahman Al Thani at the Foreign Ministry's headquarters on Monday. Following their talks, the two ministers held a joint press conference where Shukri affirmed Egypt's keenness on boosting joint cooperation in different domains during the coming period. For his part, the Qatari official reiterated that both sides agreed on continuing coordination and intensifying cooperation in the economic, cultural and sports fields. He also said that Qatar is looking forward to form a joint committee to discuss several issues of common interest. These were some of the stories making the news today, but now, focusing our attention on the Egypt Can With Industry Conference, let's check out this report regarding the Egypt Can With Industry Conference, supporting economic developments and kicking off and focusing also on clean energy. Let's check out this report and we'll be right back. <laughs> 